Howdy y'all, Uncle T here. Welcome you to another video of a nice motorcycle ride up a nice road in Citrus County, Florida. Today, we're gonna to be heading up Fort Island Trail, which takes us all the way to the Gulf from downtown Crystal River. As you can see right here, I sped this one up a bit, like I said, I was gonna to try to do. So if y'all have a, an opinion on that, I'd sure love to hear about it. I don't know if you like it or not. It kind of looks weird to me, but it speeds things along, so there you go. Now coming up just on our left, you'll be able to see as we come out of warp speed is the Plantation Golf Course. It's a beautiful little course. Uh, rumor was back in the late 50s, early 60s, Arnold Palmer used to go practice there for the Masters because the greens were very similar. And uh, as you can see here, we turn right into the plantation resort itself. Uh, the reason I'm going in here is because I want to show you all this new fountain that they just put in. And it's really pretty and it's marbly looking and uh, they spent a lot of money on it. So I thought maybe y'all would like to see that. back out to the main road which is Fort Island Trail and we'll head west out towards the Gulf. back into warp speed. Now, if y'all like these videos, please feel free to like and subscribe and to uh, ring that bell thingy so you get notifications because every time I put one out, you'll get a notification, I guess. And uh, I plan to put out a lot more videos, not just motorcycling stuff which is kind of cool I like doing that and I like showing everybody the beautiful area that we live in but uh, I'd love to introduce a lot more different stuff like uh, kayaking some of the really beautiful spots and springs that we have here and some of the uh, other sites that we have and you know in, in Citrus County the real big thing here is the tourism and the big thing that brings the tourists in is the manatees. We have a lot of manatees come in in the winter time, and I'm going to do a little video on that down the road soon. So keep an eye out for that. So if you subscribe and ring that bell, you'll be able to get all these subsequent videos that I'll be bringing out for you.
All right, coming out of warp speed again. We're pulling into the Citrus County boat launch. It's a pretty nice boat launch. It's free for now. And uh, it's a nice facility. It's got the washrooms and it's got a nice double ramp for y'all to launch your boats if that's your thing. And there's also a fishing pier and a bathroom area on the other side. If I'd have gone straight there, I'll go over there in a minute just to show y'all. Look at this here squirrel. Just like those cartoons, keeps running in front of you instead of turning off. Right there's the boat launches and the bathrooms and some place to throw your garbage. Park your trailers, go out and have a great day fishing or just enjoying the sunshine here in Florida. See on the right here is where the fishing pier is and there's a little area you can have a barbecue or stay out of the sunshine in that little pavilion there and this is right on the crystal river right before it splits into the two systems which is the crystal river and the salt river Back into hyperdrive again. We we're just gonna speed things along. We're headed back onto the main road here and we're gonna head out towards the Gulf. Now we're about to go over the Crystal River right here. And just that white building up on your right ahead there, that is the um, oceanography school for the kids. Now that they have really good grades in this area, they are allowed to go out here and learn about oceanography and the environment, and they can do courses here that actually count towards uh, college courses down the road and uh, they also get a diploma from here and from the regular school that they were going to so it's a pretty good deal if you're a good student you might like it there
here we are coming up to the beach. The beach is on the left. And again, it has the little pavilions there and barbecues that are built in so you can barbecue, just bring your briquettes and your lighters fluid. And the beautiful Gulf of Mexico. Here we are at the end of the road. That's it for Fort Island Trail. But as you'll see here, there's another public boat launch, free to use for the public. But we ain't done yet. I got a couple other things I'm gonna show you here. This here is a boardwalk slash pier system. Comes in through the wetlands and the bushes here and goes out into the Gulf of Mexico for a bunch of people to go out there and fish all day long and enjoy the beautiful Florida weather. There's the folks out fishing. There's the beach we just went by, just over there. And as I swing around, and you see the shoreline on the right, uh, all around this area, there's uh, all that growth of mangroves that are coming up. They were killed off all back in, I believe it was 83, when we had a really cold snap in Florida. And uh, they're all just coming back like gangbusters now, which we're glad to see. It's a great. Uh, way to have the ecosystem build up for the fishes and all that. Now that's here's the boardwalk that takes us over to the beach. Here we are at the beach. There's one of them built-in barbecues I was telling you about and the little pavilion and the beach there. It's got the rope across it and the bathroom, change room, and showers are over there to get the salt water off you. Well, I'd like to thank you all very much for joining us today. Hope you all had a good trip with us. Uh, please feel free to like, share, and do all the other stuff. We'd appreciate it. And subscribe. Thanks for coming. Bye.